I can remember when it was just my mother and me. We used to live in a kingdom very far from here. Apparently we were quite poor, but I didn't know it. I just remember being happy and playing in a garden filled with flowers. I remember it always used to be so bright and warm there. Not like here. Here the winters are dark and cold and there is altogether too much snow. I like to imagine that someday it will just be me and my mother again. I daydream that snow marries a prince from a kingdom far away. He can be handsome, he can be rich, just as long as his kingdom is oh so far away. That's the important detail here. He and Snow will leave and live happily ever after, as I'm told princesses are supposed to do. She's welcome to that as well. As long as she enjoys that happiness far away from me. Unfortunately, things are more complicated than that. Snow will never leave the kingdom. The people expect her to rule. She's the true-born daughter of the fairest, whatever that means. They put a lot of store by it here. The throne is passed down by blood from fairest to fairest. A foreign ruler has never taken the throne here, so that makes me and my mother some sort of devious usurpers or something. They'll never accept us here. When Snow comes of age, I'll be forced to live in her stupid shadow forever. So you can see why I wish she would just marry a prince and leave. I don't get it. The people, they don't even know what she's like. She's not that special, honestly. It's not like she's uncommonly kind and brave or has tiny woodland creatures following her around, helping her with tasks. It's just about who she is. They never look past it to see what she is. And what she is, is annoying. I used to think that I had a shot at being queen, you know? But I'm starting to think that I'm going to be overlooked in that, like I am in everything else. I don't think I can stand being Snow's sister any longer. But I guess I'll just have to dream that someday her prince will come.